you get question number 77 what does it mean to say that jesus christ is at the same time true god and true man in jesus god really became one of us and thus our brother nevertheless he did not cease to be god at the same time and thus our lord the council of chalcedon in the year 451 taught that the divinity and the humanity in the one person jesus christ are united together without division or confusion the church grappled for a long time with the problem of how to express the relation between the divinity and the humanity of Jesus Christ divinity and humanity are not in competition with each other which would make Jesus only partially god and only partially man nor is it true that the divine and human in Jesus are confused God took on a human body in Jesus this was not mere appearance but he really became man nor are there two different persons in Christ one human and one divine nor is it true finally that in Jesus Christ the human nature was completely absorbed into the divine nature Contrary to all these heresies the church has adhered to the belief that Jesus Christ is at the same time true god and true man in one person the famous formula without division or confusion does not attempt to explain something that is too sublime for human understanding but rather draws the boundaries so to speak of the faith It indicates the line along which the mystery of the person of Jesus Christ can be investigated. Roman liturgy on January 1st says he remained what he was and he assumed what he was not. Gospel of John chapter 14 verse 10 says do you not believe that I am in the father and the father is in me the words that i say to you i do not speak on my own authority but the father who dwells in me does his works jeremy taylor says a religious without mystery is necessarily a religion without god question number 78 why can we grasp jesus only as a mystery jesus extends it to god therefore we cannot understand him if we exclude that invisible divine reality the visible side of jesus points to the invisible we see in the life of jesus numerous realities that are powerfully present but that we can understand only as a mystery example of such mysteries are the divine sonship the incarnation the passion and the resurrection of christ caught again jeremy taylor a religion without mystery is necessarily a religion without god god bless you all